This is my nighttime routine. So the first step in my nighttime routine is these bad boys. I know makeup wipes are not good for you because they rub and they scrub, but I'm the laziest person when I get home from work and I just want to take it all off really fast. As you can see, I have a lot of dark spots because I used to have a lot, a lot, a lot of acne. I'm sure a lot of you go through it, but puberty hit me hard, like real hard. And I know I'm rubbing really hard, but my skin is really strong. I have African jeans, so I can do what I want. It's my face. Ta-da! Clean face. I don't usually like to cleanse because I've noticed that when I cleanse, it breaks out my skin. And cleansing can be good for other people, but my skin does not like the soapy, like it strips all the oils and I break out. So what I do after, I take a little towelette, one of these bad boys, and I wet it. And I just go like this. And I press it down. It's so refreshing to do that. It makes me feel like, who am I? My face is so clean. I'm looking all, you know? I like, I can't do the whole like soap, wash. This is like the only thing I do and it just makes my skin feel so good and so soft. So what I do after I take off all my makeup and use my little towelette, I use this Tasha Luminous Dewy Skin Mask. My face is always dry and I need lots of moisture and hydration. I open it all the way up and I get it right on my face. I know. Beautiful, I know, you don't have to tell me. So this is the Mizani um, Milk Miracle and I usually do this routine after I put my mask on because I have a little bit of time. I spritz it all over my hair because my, you know, African hair needs a lot of moisture. And while that is sinking in there and marinating, I take my trusty comb and I just like, Pick my hair. Pick, 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 pick. And I know I'm looking aggressive, but you know, I'm not. This is this is what I have to do. It's like a little like massage with this comb. So it's been about 10 minutes now and I'm gonna take this off before I finish my hair routine and my face routine. And you can see that it came off with, you know, some of the makeup that I left over here. And what I do with this is I basically rub it and dab it. I just make sure that all the Goodness that is supposed to be in the mask is in there and I'm looking flawless. The mask is something that I do every night because I basically work almost every single day and my skin loses a lot of hydration with, you know, all the makeup that's been put on. After I take off my mask, I use this Tasha Violet C Brightening Serum because a lot of dark skin people know this. Our skin scars very easily and especially if you had acne before like I did. I use this to just like brighten up the dark spots so I don't like to put it on my hands because I feel like I'm wasting the product and I only put it on the spot that I have like dark spots. So I take the serum and I literally just like drop a few drops on my skin and rub it on the dark spots right there and then I do it the same on this side rub 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 and then I do it right here on the forehead and actually a good tip that I learned from a very good makeup artist um, her name is Erin Parsons I work with her with Maybelline I take a few drops of this and I put it under my eyes because I don't want no wrinkles I know people are like, oh my god, you're dark skin, you're never gonna get wrinkles. I see them coming. So I put it under my eyes, I know I'm supposed to like dab or rub, but again, my face, my rules. And while that is settling in, my favorite part of my nighttime routine is my do bag. This is literally my favorite thing because I, first of all, pink is my favorite color. And I just feel like, I don't know, I just feel like my hair is just, just, just baking. It's just getting moisturized. So what I do is I... This is actually a recent purchase. I used to use a t-shirt. It's like an old t-shirt. But um, I realized that I'm just ruining a lot of t-shirts and I actually want to wear my t-shirts. So what I do is I tie it. And I make sure I get the little like side hairs. And then, you know, 
So what the do-rag basically does is um, it sets my hair after I moisturize it, after I picked it. I want to wake up with my hair looking good. I don't want to spend 45 minutes in the morning doing my hair. So the do-rag basically keeps it flat. The edges looking smooth. You see this part in the front and makes the edges stay smooth and down. And it just like doesn't create like friction or frizz when I sleep. Because if I don't have this on, I wake up and my hair will be like... And I don't want that. I just want to wake up, have like... Flawless hair, flawless skin, and this literally keeps my hair in check. After I'm, you know, letting this set my hair, this Tasha Luminous Dewy Skin Mist. I go through this like crazy. I like spritz it all over when I have makeup on, when I'm going to bed, when I wake up. It's like my favorite thing to do. If you want dewy skin, it's so good. I love it. And what I do is I spritz it out into the air a little bit so I don't get too much on my skin. And then I try to do it on my skin. That felt like a, that felt like a skincare commercial. I'm like, but that's what I do, and it smells so lovely, and my skin looks so dewy, which I love because I have really really dry skin. My next part of my routine is my. Tasha Water Cream Moisturizer. I know it, it looks like I'm using a lot of Tasha, but it took me forever to find a skincare brand that works on my skin because I have like discoloration and acne and like, you know, different tones on my skin and it's like darker and then my neck is lighter. It's just like, it took me forever to find a good skincare routine. So once I found it, I tried to basically stick to it. And I am <laughs> almost out, literally. <laughs> And I generously lather this on my face. Like, I take so much of it. And it has this little, like, spatula situation, but no one has time for that. I take so much. And I lather it on my face. So I lather and I let it sit there like a mask. And I don't forget the neck because everyone says the neck. And I let it sit there for about five minutes. Like I said before, I suffer from acne. And honestly, like, I know what it's like because you feel so insecure when you have spots on your face. And you feel like people are not looking at your eyes when they're talking to you, they're looking at your skin. But I realize that it's psychological. Like, no one's looking at your pimples. No one is literally looking at your pimples and being like, oh my gosh, she's not beautiful. People want to talk to you and they see your beautiful smile and they see your heart and that's all that matters. And I have learned to train my mind to think that it's just pimples. Like, everyone has them. People are just good at hiding them. But I'm good at embracing them. So, my next step in my routine is I take this tea tree oil. I take this and I'm supposed to use a Q-tip, but like I said, I'm very resourceful and I just, just use what God gave me. I take my finger and I go like that and I apply it on the pimples, just a few. And you don't really need a lot of this. You just need a little bit and it smells so good, but it's also really good for acne and that's what I use on the spots that I get. Next on my routine is my trusted Aquaphor. I don't want dry lips ever, and I shoot a lot of beauty. Girl, I cannot have dry lips on camera. It just does not look flattering. It just, I can't shoot lipstick commercial with dry lips. So I use Aquaphor and I go through these all the time. It's so great. I love it. The last step on my nighttime routine is I take my vitamins because I forget to take them in the morning. So I take them at night and usually I let them do whatever it needs to do to my body when I'm sleeping and I take vitamin D3 because as a dark skinned woman I need a lot of sun, like a lot of it in order to feel like good inside and outside. And vitamin D just literally makes me feel like I've got some sun and my actual doctor recommended this. So I take this and other vitamins, but this is literally the one that I always take every night. Pop it in my mouth. Skull. And that's about it. Thank you so much for watching my nighttime routine. I had so much fun doing this. 